When we talk about liver tumors and liver cancers, specifically we're talking about uh, hepatobiliary and pancreatic tumors or cancers um, and surgery for those. And that involves um, surgery on either the liver, the bile ducts, or the pancreas. In this service we call, we refer to it a lot as HPB or hepatobiliary pancreatic surgery. This service was developed under the umbrella of liver transplantation here at the Nebraska Medical Center to serve patients who have uh, tumors, whether they be benign or malignant tumors in their liver, bile duct, and pancreas, um, and don't necessarily need transplantation, um, but could benefit from resectional therapy. Some patients present with symptoms and some patients are asymptomatic and uh, tumors in these areas are found incidentally uh, uh, on a workup for something else maybe. Um, and so not necessarily every patient has symptoms. There are tumors involved either in the liver or the bile duct or the pancreas. Some of the tumors are benign like a cystic lesion uh, or tumor or um, a hemangioma all the way to um, malignancies and cancers in these different areas. So there's lots of different options uh, when a patient comes with a tumor or a cancer um, that the surgeons have to offer. Lots of different resectional therapies. A lot of times if it's a tumor in the liver, um, sometimes it's a primary tumor uh, that originates in the liver. Sometimes it's a metastatic tumor that's spread uh, from a cancer elsewhere in the body. Um, and the surgeons here can offer uh, resection of that lesion and sometimes uh, an additional part of the liver to uh, remove all of the cancer. The liver does uh, regenerate um, in about six to eight weeks after surgery. So we watch them closely after and we see them in clinic again. We watch their labs and uh, watch any imaging studies. It's also uh, a multidisciplinary approach. And so we feel like we have best care in the region to offer these patients with the four surgeons that we work with. Um, but it's also a very multidisciplinary specialized approach. We work with a world-renowned oncology team, uh, gastroenterologists and hepatologists, interventional radiologists, radiologists, pathologists, um, and so it's a wide variety uh, of people working on one case and lots of options to offer and uh, thorough follow-up in all of those disciplines. I think it's pretty neat that the four surgeons that we work with are transplant surgeons and so they are specialized um, you know, in the liver, the bile ducts, the pancreas, that whole hepatobiliary system, this is their specialty. Uh, not only do they do transplants, but they offer other, you know, specialized surgeries in these areas and for these patients. We can offer surgeries uh, for palliative therapy uh, to control symptoms if that's the issue, um, but a lot of times our goal is complete you know, complete resection of a tumor, cancer, malignancy, um, and give the patient the best option for long-term survival. Anytime you hear the word cancer, uh, it's a very scary situation for everyone involved. And so to provide patients with one central place where there are multiple experts and many options available uh, is very gratifying. <laughs>